Well, the talk is now that Kamala Harris will choose her vice presidential nominee tomorrow. Some people are saying the list is down to just two now, Shapiro from Pennsylvania and Walls from Minnesota. Now, I don't know if that's true. A lot of people have predictions, prognostications, their favorites, whatever, but nobody really knows. The only people that know are Kamala Harris and the people around her. So we just have to wait and see what happens. Now, the important thing to understand is no matter who she picks, she's going to be fine. All of the candidates are wonderful. All have different qualities and different advantages. So I'm not really worried about who she's going to pick. Whoever she picks is going to be overshadowed by Kamala Harris, because right now she is a force of nature. What we have to do as a people is keep this momentum going, keep this excitement going. Donald Trump's only argument against Kamala Harris is, is she really black? Is she black? <laughs> that is so fucking lame, it's unbelievable. And we'll see if there is a debate. We know that there's one scheduled for September 10th on ABC. Donald Trump is terrified to go to that event, but instead he's trying to create one out of whole cloth, a debate on Fox News on September 4th that isn't a thing. There's been nothing contracted to get this done. He just needs this as an excuse to get out of the September 10th. But when it gets down to it and he sees Kamala Harris is going to have a couple hours on national television by herself, he may not be able to handle it. He doesn't make the best choices. His people around him will say, don't do the debate. But Donald Trump doesn't listen to shit, so we'll see how this turns out.